Okay, for this tutorial, I'm gonna be using Visual Studio's code. Okay, so we're gonna do the our Hello World. Just like, uh, you know, every tutorial starts out. So all you gotta do is put print line. Okay. Hello world. All right, and the extension for V files are .v. Okay, so let's save that. Okay. And to compile this, all you do is V, so hello world, okay? Bam, there you go. So we're gonna run this. And there you go, you got your first hello world right there, okay? All right, next. Now you can just do it regular like that, but I think it's better to put it into a main function like this. So print line. And then we can do hello world again. We'll put a two there just so you know that it's, um, just so you know that this is a new, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a different, you know, we did this a different way. Okay, so let's do it again. All right, and just like go, you don't have to terminate it with, uh, you don't have to terminate each line with a semicolon. The compiler will actually holler at you if you try to do that right there. So let me just show you. Okay. Yep. So it won't, it won't even allow you to do it, right? This language is is very, very, very similar to Go. I would say that if Go and um, if Go and Rust had a baby, it would be V. So 